My name is Tansy and welcome to today's video. So today's video is a dressing room try on video and I went over to Kmart to see what they had there. The last time I was in Kmart I noticed that they started putting out some awesome stuff and I thought let me see what's there before it all gets snatched away and we don't know what there is. It is me it is awesome now actually but today is like boiling hot as though it's hotter than it was ever in summer. Summer just came and went this year and I don't know where it went but I'll be honest with you I'm kind of glad because I don't like the heat that much. So I will say all the stuff that I tried on is some of it you I guess you can still wear in summer but it is the transition into autumn to winter which I think we're all happy to kind of see because I don't know sometimes like you get sick of the summer trends and you're like I'm ready to move on to the next season and as we all know Kmart is pretty inexpensive however the plus section is very 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 lacking they still haven't done anything about making it any better than what it is like very little to choose from and so outdated I will say that the straight section does go up to a 20 so a lot of the items do have stretch so I do try on some 20s because I know people who watch me are all different like sizes so you never know what might fit you or alternatively the way I say it what I might squeeze into which I know is not the best thing we don't want to do but if it fits it fits I was hoping to rhyme that and then I thought if it fits that doesn't go with anything <laughs> So let's start off with the first item that I saw and it was this beautiful baby blue cardigan. Now the fabric of this was so soft. It was like, you know that, how can I smell? Like a nice plush pillow even. So comfortable. Now I tried this on an 18 as they didn't have a 20. I think the 20 probably would have fit on me a lot better. However, I am one that usually does wear my cardigans kind of just one button or, or open so I feel like size wise it still fit me pretty good now if I was going to wear it buttoned you could see the buttons are you know gaping so it's definitely too small in that respect especially for my chest however if you do like a button of a top or a button in the middle or even open it still fit and looked really good now I'm a cardigan gal through and through I absolutely love cardigans I feel like for autumn they are the absolute best thing that you can wear because it's like it's layers you know if you're hot you can take it off if not put on but best of all you can actually like you know pull up the sleeves and you're pretty done and if you're someone who just likes wearing things with sleeves cardigans you know they come in all different like colors and even like patterns and whatever so great this one is definitely one i recommend because it was so cute the blue was just gorgeous and it was so soft that one retails for 25 dollars next up t-shirts are on the rage they were everywhere it reminded me of the 90s so so much the fashion that is in right now is so 90s i remember wearing this stuff and some of the stuff i remember wanting to wear it but i just didn't have the funds for it because i believe like i probably just started working and i was you know saving for nike Air max back in those days however I thought I'd try on a t-shirt with the Spice Girls on there. I thought mainly I'd try it on because I like the kind of crop to it. So I actually liked the style of the t-shirt. Now, I know a lot of people are like sick and tired of t-shirts. But t-shirts are like so comfy. And they are so 90s as well. Because honestly, as a kid, I do remember just wearing t-shirts. We used to wear t-shirts and bike shorts or t-shirts and jeans. Just big baggy stuff. And it was so, so comfy back in those days because the big jeans were in back then too. However, there were so many like band tees and other kind of things that are popular. I was looking out for new kids on the block and they didn't have one because I would have snapped that up if they definitely did. However, if you want a t-shirt, you know, make it funky, make it yourself. I like cropped or if it's not cropped, I would cut it cropped just for a little bit of something different. Or otherwise you could even like do a few tears into your t-shirt to give it like a dis distressed room. Stands you can't speak a distressed look this t-shirt that i tried on was an 18 and i feel like the size actually was pretty decent i don't feel like i even needed a bigger size possibly because i like the way it sat on me like i still had room to move someone had torn off the price so i will pop the price on the screen after i look it up <laughs> next up i saw this like black floral top and i tried it on in a size 20. now what stood out at me with this top was the fact that this sort of bit through the middle here you could like it so you could make it like a lower V or you could pull it up and the top could come up higher this for me because I'm larger busted is perfect because then I could work out exactly like where I wanted to sit and without it feeling uncomfortable because generally when you're larger bust 
busted you need like a bit of room to move up here so none of us really like well i personally don't like things coming up too high it just i feel a bit suffocated i will say however with this fabric it's a little bit see-through so you definitely would need to wear like a black bra because even a nude or i was wearing like a pinky bra you could see it through the top or maybe you don't even care the sleeves had elastic down the wrist over here overall this was a size 20 but i feel like it fit me pretty decently now i don't know if some of their items are made a little bit bigger and therefore like me being a 22 i can fit into it but i feel like for me personally i like the way it sat on me and i thought it was a cute top that top retails for 15 dollars next up i saw this skirt and i grabbed it in a size 20 and i was like i don't know if it's gonna fit me but it fit and it is so cute. It just was gave me 90s vibes. Like it is a mini skirt. And you know me, I'm not one that wears short skirts. But I figured this with some black stockings underneath. How cute would it look? I mean you definitely don't even need black stockings. But I just feel like black like turtleneck. The black stockings, the skirt. So cute. Like so wintry and just so like on style. I really really thought it was cute. I love the little like split that he had on the front. The skirt actually had stretch to it. So the 20 actually worked really good for me. A 22 probably would have sat a lot like better I suppose. But the 20 still did fit and I quite liked it. I like the like black and white pattern. You could wear any colour top with that which I also liked. So if you're after something like that definitely check it out. That skirt retails for $15 and I absolutely think that that is a bargain. Next up, I saw that they had this like shrug and I was like, oh my gosh, remember when we used to wear those? Now, okay, that's not, I wouldn't say that was in the 90s. I feel like I wore that in the 2000s, 2000 era. Yeah, I guess, I, well, I guess the 90s, when we're saying 90s, it's the late 90s. So therefore, this would be the early 2000s. I lived for these items. I thought that they were fantastic. Fantastic way to wear your summer stuff into winter without altering an outfit. I feel like shrugs are so underrated. Like especially if you want to go out somewhere. Like say you've got a nice dress. A cardigan. A jacket. Anything ruins the look of a dress. It really does. Like it hides. So you have to take it off in order to show off your dress. But if you're cold you got to keep it on and your dress doesn't look that great. However, with like a shruggy thing, I think they're called a shrug, you know, with the sleeves. I feel like that still keeps your outfit as it is, keeps your arms co covered so you're warm and just still looks really good. Now, this was a more wintry fabric. It was like that thick in knit material. And this was a size 18 to 20 and I had plenty of room to move. Now, look at these babies. They're ginormous. I had plenty of room to move so I definitely recommend if you're a size 24 even a 26 I believe it would work for you because even in the shoulder area I had plenty of room and this is something that you could just keep wearing year after year even if it's like not in fashion per se it is something that like I would still wear. They had it in black only from what I could see but black works with everything. Also I feel like black especially in winter is very versatile because I don't know about you I'm very much a black boots type of gal in winter so therefore a uh, black shrug would work but i feel like these in like plenty of different colors would totally work and then even like lighter fabrics maybe even for like going out that would work too but this one didn't have a price but i'll look it up and pop it on the screen next up another cardigan and i grabbed this in a size 20 now i love this color it's kind of like a little magenta purple and so pretty now i love cardigans as i said so i really like the style of this i do like the cropped versions because i just feel like they sit a lot better when you're wearing skirts and i am generally like a skirt and top person which i feel like is quite easy so therefore i kind of still like to have the waist area cinched in so i feel like a crop allows for that and kind of still without covering the skirt because a lot of my skirts have cute you know up the top and i like them to sit up high therefore i i usually would have to wear the cardigan open in order to see the top of the skirt so therefore if a cardigan is like a bit more of a crop style i like to wear it buttoned up you know i guess we all have our own way of the way we like to do things as i said this was comfortable love the color the buttons were pretty easy to maneuver i'll also pop the size up on the screen to let you guys know so when i saw this shirt i was definitely thinking ring 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 hello the 90s called because it just reminded me of an outfit that i had that had this like flannelette style shirt white top underneath some jeans and some what those colorado shoes were in back then 
loved that look and I used to wear like a long necklace as well so yes this gave me that vibe but I love the purple I love purple so much this shirt was very oversized now I grabbed it in a size 20 it was swimming on me there was so much room to move and apart from like if it wasn't that short you could probably even wear it as a dress but I love that there's room to move so if you wanted to you could wear it buttoned up you could wear it open however you liked and you know what for something like I don't normally wear oversized but I actually think it sat really nicely on for something that was oversized I feel like it was actually cut really nicely so it was a, it was like a more on the thinner side of the fabric but in the shoulders this is where I usually have the issues the shoulders and the arm sleeves they usually make them a bit too short and I feel like I look weird this was actually cut really Really nicely and I honestly feel like it stayed really nicely on me you had the pockets I mean the color is what drew me to it I'm pretty sure there was like browns and other colors but this color is so cute so definitely recommend checking out if you're after a shirt like that this one is so cute and that one retails for $25 Next up, the only item that I kind of found in the plus section was this dress. Now, I grabbed it in a size 22 and I pretty much grabbed it because it had a belt attached to it. Look at the fabric wise, uh, it wasn't something I loved. Like the pattern was like, mm, I don't know, I don't know if I would love wearing that. But also the style of the dress was just a little bit too plain for my liking I mean no I like plain a little bit frumpy perhaps I mean on the camera I think it looked pretty decent I just you know me it's just not 100% my style but I feel like the belt just elevated the look just adding that black belt and then if you have black booties I think it would look very very cute now me in particular I undid the buttons up the top and I actually liked it sitting as a v-neck because I feel like there was less of that patterns up the top here so I personally would do that but you know each to their own of how they want to wear it the dress also down the bottom it was quite interesting so the dress kind of fell but then the bottom had an extra like cut out sort of section with like a little roughly kind of bit which was actually quite pretty the fabric was very like soft it was one of those like wash and goes definitely I like that it was long sleeve and there was elastic on the bottom of the sleeves as well. All in all, the size 22 fit me perfectly. I don't think I even needed to size up or down. I feel like it actually stayed really nicely on. So if you're after something a bit autumn-y that you're ready to like jump into, check it out. That one retails for $35. And lastly, still in the straight section, I came across this black dress that I was like, this is a Stansy style dress. Now, I grabbed this in a size 20 and I feel like the 20 was actually a good fit for me. Now, it was pretty much similar to the fabric of the shrug. So it's like a thicker kind of knit. And I love that it had the two like splits on the side. I think it sat really nicely on. Nice long sleeve. Even up the top, it didn't feel too like high up. And I feel like overall it sat comfortably it will it felt comfortably and sat nicely i really like how the sleeves had the little bit that kind of came in and they billowed out a tiny little bit like in looking at this dress honestly it actually looks more expensive than what it actually is just like something that i can see in like witchery or somewhere or jackie e like because i do see them but you know with like a kmart price tag and sometimes kmart like when they make this fabric they don't sit as nicely like honestly i've tried on other stuff and in the past i've been like a mm, while oh, I like it you just needed a little something this actually I think is that really really nicely so I definitely recommend imagine like a black sweater dress you could wear year after year after year with some like high boots or short boots so so cute and definitely one that like you don't spend a lot and then you're probably gonna wear it like all the time because especially in black you can wear it to anything you can pop a belt if you wanted to and and feel like you've changed up the outfit now that one retails for $30 and I feel like $30 is an absolute bargain for something that you probably keep for a long, long time. And that is everything that I tried on at Kmart. I was like so surprised that they had a whole new bunch of stuff. So I was like, let me jump in on this. Let me try stuff out for you guys before it all disappears off the shelves. And we just don't see it again because I feel like sometimes they don't restock it. Yes, they put other stuff, but I know you guys like to see stuff that's affordable like Kmart. And I'll be honest, I, I kind of liked all the stuff that I tried on. So if you're after something new, go to Kmart and go check them out.
And that's it for today's video, guys. Comment down below and let me know what was your favorite item that I tried on. Also, have you been shopping lately at Kmart and have you bought anything? Do you already have any of these items? Let me know. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed, hit that subscribe button below and give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and if you like just in room try on videos. That way I know to keep them coming. And once again, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.